school, our house. How long you guys been here? We've lived in Ghana 11 years. 11 years? Wow. Yes. Wow. Yes, yes. What we're featuring is uh, what we call in Jamaica Ital food, but what everyone else calls vegan. The original name, especially for the Jamaican uh, who doesn't eat meat, because it was really started by Rasta. It was a Rasta Liberty, and right. they called it Ital. Even salt was not even included in Ital originally. Oh. No meat. No, uh, no salt at wow. all, and a lot of the dishes were uh, cooked with coconut milk or coconut juice. It's called gizada. We call it gizada. Gizada. Yeah, wow. yeah. So it's flour with uh, coconut inside. It's a sweet pastry. Then we have kebabs. We have sweet potato pudding. So it's made sweet potato with spices that wow. makes that. We have salad. We have jerk tofu, fried plantain. Yellow rice. See, this is rice and peas. This is cooked with coconut milk. Yeah. And then we have the yellow rice. Delicious. Yeah. And we have uh, aki. I don't know if you know of aki. This is actually Jamaica's national dish. But originally, if you're a meat eater, they cook it with fish, but we use mushroom. So we cook aki with mushroom. This one is chickpeas, curry chickpeas. And this is coconut, uh, lentil cooked in coconuts. Yes, yeah, in a coconut. And we have a wide variety of juices. We have pineapple noni. We have sorrel, which Ghanaians call sobolo. Yeah, but we call it sorrel. Sorrel? Sorrel, yeah. And then we have. Uh, I think uh, plum, there is a plum tree that we have here that we use a plum to make juice. Sorrel, pineapple noni, pineapple ginger, plum, green juice. I'm not sure if all is still available at the moment. So this is my husband, Abacha. Yes, but how are you? here the last time. <laughs> how are you doing? Okay, 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 okay. okay. So yeah, let me go ahead and find a table and all right. try these delicious foods. Oh, that food was delicious here at Jamaica sitting. Beautiful Akopam mountain area. And I enjoy the food. Really, really nice and tasty. When it comes to vegan food, because this, all this is vegan, man, uh, uh, flavor is very important. If y'all around, come check them out. All right, come on. Let's go for a walk. Let's look at more of the property. So I heard they have plum trees. So tell me a little bit about this whole, your, your whole place here is nice. Um, it's a plan live in Jamaica because this is what we used to do in Jamaica. Okay. Uh, Agro-tourism is the new thing of the day. Right. So, if you are able to arrange your plantation in such a way that visitors can pass through, see the different things, know some people have never seen some things before, right. then it, it provides added income mm. to your plantation. You understand? So this was set up based on agro-processing and agro-tourism. If you turn your thing and watch all of this land, mm -hmm. at any place in the world you are from, mm -hmm. there is a place here that can hold you. You understand? Yeah. The people in the diaspora should know that they should come home. Who have the money can come and see, or who don't have the money. Think well, think of what you do, what mm -hmm. you are professional at, and you can make it here. This one is the citronella. Citronella, right? Yeah, this is citronella. Whoa. We, we do the oils also in small quantities. Oh. Citronella, I heard of that. Yeah. No, depends. Mm, this is citronella, yeah. yeah. So I'm going to get this citronella. Rub it on everybody. Yeah, it smells really nice. 
Yeah, but how do you make oil? Okay. Well, you have to press it. Dad, wow, they have a whole bunch of these. Look at a whole bunch of these bugs around. Oh, you also a grasshopper. Hey, come in, Nick. Hey, grasshopper. Hey, Noni tree, look at that. Oh, yeah. This is beautiful, y'all. Look at the water is out there. See that water? And I don't know what this mountain is. Beautiful. This is a view that is priceless. Look at the clouds. It looks like it's in the earth. It looks like it. I'm on top of the world. I'm on top of the world. I'm on top of the world. This is a view that you could just sit back and look at. Yeah, no mosquitoes up here. You can chill up here, sip your tea, sip your coffee. Joshua, you wanna push me? What are you gonna push me for? Let's go, let's go, let's push, push you. <laughs> push you. Daddy, push you. So this is our experience here. Beautiful time, beautiful views, tasty food. We're good. All right, y'all. Till next time. Peace.